is going to stick around. It's in 80% oh of the stock, and once it's gone, it is gone. This is a limited run. Okay, as it were, because once it's gone, it's gone. It's it? gone, and the, if I was to reorder, which we don't do every time, it'll be a couple of months, and like you've had to wait for that other collection for two months. So, so it's going to be know. two months before we reorder if it. If I reorder it. If we reorder <laughs> it. I, I use the royal way. I have nothing to do with this, may I add. Uh, so if we do, if we do reorder it. It's going to take you two months to get it. Uh, so it's worth having a little look now. Twenty-two pounds and forty-nine pence. If you're in the club, uh, from there we move on to your doodle frames now. With your doodle frames that you've got on here, <laughs> the camera didn't move, so I thought it just stopped. <laughs> I just thought like slow mode, just in case. Uh, with the doodle frames, these are hard to do. I find they are. I mean, I did sketch these, I did do these myself, but it took me a long time. I was playing with them, I was faffing with them, they got digitised, I took pieces away, I added pieces. But to go in with a pen, it's scary, in my opinion, because if I've done a nice masterpiece in the centre, and I ruin it on the last bit of a line, I'm going to get That's really annoyed. So, you know, it's taken that fear factor away from you. And it's particularly if you're using the Eureka to stamp it, you're not going to have the scariness of it. You can mask it off, use it in a light colour, use it in gold, use it as a fretwork if you want to, doodle within, santangle within, zentangle within, whatever you actually love to do. Do masking techniques with them and you've got all of the sizes to start from a big one and you can absolutely connect them and make square ones don't be afraid of them both florals are left and a right so if you do want to do a bouquet you can absolutely do that don't be scared of them they're there to help you these are going to be uh, essential stamps rather than focal points well they are because even if you just did the corner that's all you need to do, just stamp up that corner and then leave it up there. Or you just do the top, if you wanted to do just the top, you go that way. Do it in a green and add some of your foliage that we've got coming up, it would look like vines. Yeah, and flip, yeah, it absolutely would, that's a great idea, great so shout is that one. Do yeah, it in absolutely. your browns and your colours like that, you've then also got like sort of vine leaves and you could take your vines off this, like your climbing ivy and things like that. But as they get slightly smaller, the borders get more beautiful for the sheer fact. You go in with a pen and try and do these. As Tony said on the last bit, how many times have you gone in with a pen and your ink's still been wet underneath so everything's then bled? Yeah, so last time we were here when we brought these to you, we sold over a thousand bundles of these and still you all clicked over 200 people clicked the notify me when back in stocks. It's a great indicator for us that there is a need for it. It's back today. We won't be bringing this back. I might do a different type of one moving forwards, but normally we've exhausted it after two. You know, it's a lot, a lot, thousands and thousands of units. So once it's gone, we might create a new one. So, and I know lots of you have been waiting for this and I hope that the people that have been waiting have managed to get it today. So once it's basically in the short of it, once it's gone, it's gone. Please it ain't don't coming email back anymore. me upset. <laughs> Well, yeah, no, you've had, you've had two don't. hours so far to I get it. I've still got a few left. Uh, two thirds of the stock now of this has already gone. Um, don't be paying 32.98 for it. By uh, become a club member and split the cost onto two interest-free flexible payments. And right then, the next four we're about to show you. We've been waiting over two months uh, to get them because they literally flew out the door two months ago when we bought you them. These are your beautiful buttercups that we talk. First of all, this. They're just, this thing's DL card. It does, slimline all the way. Equally though, you can team it up and do a square, 8x8, 7x7, 6x6, 5x5. But the design is such that, you know, you've got your really tall cards if you want. So I'm going to do a demo on this one. It's absolutely gorgeous. Open spaces, lots of open spaces so you can sit and enjoy the process of the colouring, whether it be with watercolour, acrylic, sparkle pens. Do you know? Just do what you want with them. If it's, it's, true. it's the the stamps are very happy. They're very easy on the vi eye. They're very pleasing. And like Adam said in the earlier show, these are fitting for all cards. Simple, yeah, simple. Uh, sorry, sympathy. Birthday, celebration, wedding. It doesn't really matter. Gents, females. It doesn't really matter. They work for them all. And with those large open spaces, as well, the encouragement is there to play with colour. And if you're playing with colour, that makes me very happy because I want everybody to pick up that paintbrush. But they also work in your journals. If you're a journal, yeah. don't just think, oh, I don't make cards. I do, I do my journals. You saw the card here, so that could be the edge of a page. That oh, could yeah. be the edge of your journal, the edge of your book that you're doing on. That's that could cool. be your, I reckon as well, if you did two of them and put them back to back, you could stand your card in there, you could use it as a leasel. Check you out, smart pants. It must, be, it must be awful being good all the time. Oh, well, I'm not good all the time, I just have time to think. Uh, 18 pounds and 99. I could smelt wood. 
Burning. Oh. Didn't know where that was going. £18.99 is what we're looking at for this one. Uh, it's all right. I normally bully Ed, but, uh, you know, Ed's had his moment, so it's, it's the autumn. It's my turn yeah. now. <laughs> He's passing it. Who can we bully next? We don't bully anyone here on this <laughs> channel. We don't. No one, no one is bullied. Everyone it, is very... It's a good job. It's a bit of fun, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> ca ca card making is absolute fun. That's why I absolutely love it. You know, if it's putting a smile on your face, no matter what you're doing with it, it makes me very happy. What are you laughing at? <laughs> <laughs> trying to dig us out of a little hole of bullying and back to Humphreys residence. You HR we go. Get a little spoon and fork. <laughs> Uh, let's move out 18 pounds and 99 pence for your sweet pea. Uh, we're looking at, uh, once again, the most delicate, delicate stamps that you get there. They're but so large good. stamps. These are big, big stamps that you're talking about. Once again, if you follow around the way the stamp is cut for the edge of a page and things like that, once again, journals. I mean, uh, that's the thing. Because they're big, you don't have to worry about filling the space. If it's small and dinky, you're going to be fishing around in your stash looking True. for something to fill that page. You don't have to do that with this. The stamp wow. is doing all of the talking. If you want to reduce it, it's easier to reduce than it is to have to try and make it bigger, which, you know, is, is brilliant. So there we go. So that one with the very, like, very forgiving foliage is just awesome. It looks very wild. It looks very free. I just absolutely love it. I'm sorry about that crease on there. I dropped it. Oh, I thought it was my... So, no, no, it's my card as well. I'm thankful it's not a design team card, so they can't tell me off for it. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice, though. Blingy. I just like this on craft card. Yeah. If you go for your, like, your pink frog craft card, oh, my word, it's amazing. Uh, you can then... How simple. I mean, just how in white. How simple. Yeah, ju in just white embossing powder. Oh, Boss, just done. have fun with them. That's what it's... And you've got your QR codes on the back of everything. Yes. And the QR codes take you straight to inspiration for over 1,100 videos of all the products we've brought to you on Create and Craft for the last 10 years. And we're celebrating 10 years on Create and Craft in August as well. So that's going to be a, great, be a big great big show. I need to get a big Christmas show out of the way first, though, don't I? Yeah, we've got Christmas. We've been talking about We've this. got Christmas very, very soon. It's literally oh, around the corner. Oh, gosh. Christmas in July. I can't wait. Christmas in June. I can't wait. June the 20th, I think. Something like that. Have you got your Santa hat? I don't know. Eh? Have you got your Santa hat? I'm not here. I, I do the back end of it. I only do it for about two days. All right, OK. I think it's the other Am two. I here longer than you, then? I think so, yeah. <laughs> uh, right, then. <laughs> I don't start it. Uh, these ones, I must say, we're not allowed favourites, but these ones are my favourite in this collection. Because you imagine doing these on shrink plastic, shrinking them down, little key rings, key rings yeah. putting them together to make a little floral display, putting them in, um, you know, you can get the baubles, the see-through baubles. Yeah, yeah. That you can clip together, putting them in there, because they don't have to be for Christmas. No, you could then change them into anything you wanted to be. Not. They're just beautiful, and they're sort of design and thin again, so great for your sort of slimline cards as well, but equally, bought, think about borders, corner accents, just fill in the design. I mean, that's beautiful. It's gorgeous, isn't it? I mean, silver and a bit of black. I mean, come on, spray with your water, add them as accents onto the words. This, collect, this whole stand tall collection, which is on the counter now, it's the first time we've ever reordered a complete collection where it all sold through. So normally what happens is when we bring a collection to you, there'll be three or four items which absolutely fly. The whole collection absolutely flew. I think it sold out in, what, 40 minutes or something, something like, like that? Yeah. And it was a big collection. So you've all been waiting for it. And I know that a lot of you have had favourites as individuals. The dot dash frames have been super cool. And then the next one. This one has been the busiest by far. These are sentiments with a difference. Um, because you are, and you said it in the early show, you don't do your traditional, your happy birthdays, happy anniversaries. With They're boring. Well, everybody there's does a place, them. There's a place for them, but they're boring, aren't they? And everybody does them. So I'm not going to do um, happy... I do them, and I have done them in the past. If there's a little space, I will fit an everyday sentiment in there for you. But what Stamps by Me love to do is we love to breathe sort of positivity. We like to share the love of craft. We're all in this together. So if I can give you sentiments that are going to put a smile on your face, make you feel positive about your day, you know, go out and get them. 
do it. Just do it. Well, that's You've the got thing. this. And I, 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 I was saw the other day that you went slightly in, intercontinental. You went slightly French with yes. two of them. Woohoo! Right? Laugh out loud. Mercy, you know. I, I just to be different because there's so many sentiments. How do you all create something different? Well, that's the thing. Really there's so many difficult. sentiments there, and they're sort of in the same font. And you're like, oh, what don't really. What do really I do with them now? It's difficult, isn't it, to be different? But so the only way to be different is to change the wording. Change the word, and that's what you've done here. And good. You've seen the stamps, but it doesn't really make sense with the stamps. You have to see the word stuff because you get the dies included in the kit as as well. So they give you then this, which gives you the outer edge. So you get the oh gosh or any of the others that we've got in here, but then you get to stamp just in the center with the stamps that I've just shown you. And you've seen how many there are to choose from. There are loads. And Tony will show us more when we go back over to demo uh, as well. You can do them upside down, depends how you read it. Um, you've also got as if I made this. But that's what you'll be saying to yourself. But you would not see that generally on a card, would no, you? you? Nobody does anything like that. So you know as well that when you get a card, people are going to know it's a Stamps by Me card because it's different. They're going to see it on mantelpiece and think, my gosh, that's different. Where's that from? Or did you paint that? So you're always asked a question with our sort of cards. They are different. They are unique. So you're always going to be asked the question, where did you get that from? I've never seen anything like that before. Did you paint that? No, it's true. It's true, isn't it? And you know, it's all so. these things that you will reach to again and again and again because they're usable. They're not just your happy birthdays in that in that snazzy little font. They are they are sort of down with the kids, as it were. They're modern and still classic, which I like. 60% of this now has already gone. £33.98, pence, but don't be doing that. Uh, join, become, join, oh, hello. become a member <laughs> of the club is what you're looking at. Uh, 568 691 is your item number. Jump to the website. It's the quickest and the easiest way to go. I got tongue-tied is what happened there. I got tongue-tied and I, I didn't know where I was going with the sentence. I got scared. Uh, everything individually more or less is sold out in that big bundle now. Uh, so it's worth having a look at the uh, the bigger bundle, but I don't think it's going to be here. If you like what you see, start checking out your baskets. That's all I'm going to say. There's a lot of people we sitting in baskets. I genuinely don't want you to miss out. Um, the, the people have genuinely been running around the building asking, oh, what can we do tomorrow? Can we ring other suppliers so they can see if they can do double hours? Um, which they very rarely do, to be honest. Uh, but they, they moved today. They actually got up off a chair made a couple of phone calls they were about because uh, this is going to go right I'm, then I'm what not, are we up to first i wasn't taking part in that conversation what conversation you, you were saying to don't get out of a chair <laughs> you just said you're bullying i just, I just looked down <laughs> Yeah, right, but it's bullying fun as in crafty bullying. I just, oh, I just love, I love being <laughs> crafty, crafty bullying. bullying. I just love being cheeky. That's where I'm you know, going with HR. It was crafty bullying. Cra it was yeah. just crafty bullying. You're making it worse. Stop. <laughs> okay, stop. Yeah. What are we up to? Yeah, so let's do um, the lovely <laughs> Live Your Story because this is beautiful. Like this so one. this is obviously a lamination one. It comes in that set and it's the rose. So it's just absolutely gorgeous. Today is always I, the best day. Yeah, today is always the best day, and you are living your story. Oh, so it's like a little that. bit different. So let's do the solid portion first. Is the little line there so I could put other words in there? So yeah, I could you put can, you are living your love story, or you, you can, are living your uh, last story. Or you can bolt in as well, or equally, if you don't like it, mask it off. I like it. Yeah, I, I like it too. I like so, it. So the lamination, two-part stamp, okay, which give you a very loose sort of artistic feel to your cards. It doesn't mat match up precisely. So we have other brands here like um, Alta New, yep. where they have the like four and five layers and they match up beautifully, giving you a gorgeous, crisp sort of very uh, fabric design. Really, really pretty. I've got absolutely loads of myself. These are different. Okay, these don't match up perfectly. You spray with water, so it looks like you've spent ages with the wetting wet technique with a brush. That's sort of my sort of little story, because that's what I love to do. So that's what these stamps give you. So let's show you how it works it's super super cool and you're gonna when you see the results you'll be like that is just amazing so the solid portion of your stamp super easy pick up the color I just love craft do you no, I d I'm getting into it you're I always said two and a half years ago I'll never get into it this will just be a job do you think I now I've bought my house I'm in now I have a craft room Wow I love craft I love crafty people as in people who craft because yeah. they are literally my family because that because what happens is with our QR code I've always got the camera on when I'm recording so I always get to engage with everybody and if there's not a certain person there that's always there I'm like where's that person is she all right is, is a, anything it's a you massive know, it's community massive community and I love it absolutely love it and you know family community right let's and people um, are always there to lend a hand 
I've noticed. Yeah, and everybody's willing to help. Yeah. One another. It doesn't matter what's going on in the world. Even if you're the busiest person in the world, somebody's always there to say, hey, you know what? I've got it. Leave it with me. I'll sort it. Or I'll send you this. Or don't worry about that. It's, it's just never, crazy. That, oh, that was my idea. I'm not going to share that. Like, everyone's very sharing, very open, oh, because yeah. it just takes it to the next level. Yeah, we love to share. So, a bit of colour on the so on the solid posh, and I'm going to go to colours, bit of, maybe a bit of colour, different colour in the centre, that's if they're not too alike, and then I'm going to do the green too, so green, if you're thinking, well, I don't really know where to put the colour, you've got the guide on the front so you can see where the colour goes, but equally, you've got the QR code on the back, scan the code, take you to me talking you through step by step and the process, which is really, really lovely. So then we've got some green on there, let's do a darker shade of green as well, just to add a bit of dimension texture so you just repeat the process I'm going to do a few around this card just so another tip as well is if you spray with water <gasps> it looks amazing but if you spray with pearly winks mist you get sparkly images so like pearly winks mist. third bottle it just blends into one now wet in wet is incredibly watercolor is one of the hardest sort of mediums to learn um, so I've cut out the hard work, the lessons, the classes, understanding light and shade. The stamp's doing all the talking. So there is the sort look at that. It just looks like a rose. Now, this is what I was saying about not having to use the outline if you don't want to. You could just leave that as is. So let's do, let's just move this up. So I am using the Eureka. We've got these um, on the show as well. It's a stamp platform with a difference because this is a whole craft room in a box. It is, yeah. That you're getting here. You get scoreboard, envelope maker. Uh, you get the card stock as well. You also get the brushes included with this kit. Yeah, so put a nice, nice little kit. Nice little kit. So let's just quickly do a few of these around the page. So let's um, add a different colour in this one, see if we can get it a little bit darker in the centre. And this is a great thing. You'll get it home and you will absolutely experiment with colour. You'll end up doing, you'll do one and you'll be like, oh, that's a bit nice. And then you'll go, I'm going to do another. I'm going to change for blues or purples or... And you just have so much fun, and then you'll end up batch making. Spray, spray, spray. Look at this. And I'm just doing on normal cardstock here. Absolutely nothing fancy. Now, I'd like it to have bled a little bit more on there, so I'm just going to add a bit more. And because I'm using the Eureka, I'm literally good to go. Bit. Details on the screen bit. for the big collection. Um, it's worth, I think, another 80% of that new and exclusive now is already gone. And now you think it, so I'm, I'm literally just going around the page here very quickly with all of the different colours. And um, it's not until you add the outline. You need to, if you're thinking, oh, she's boring me, I'm turning off. Just stay tuned till I put the outline on, then turn off. <laughs> no, don't, turn, don't turn off at all. I've got, t I've got two Honest, hours with you this evening. No. Uh, don't be going anywhere, but you won't see, see but put the outer edge in there. Yeah, but even it, that alone, though. It looks nice without, doesn't it? It looks, it looks like you've painted it. It looks like you've it? actually spent a bit of time painting. Yeah. And I, I just love that these stamps just make you look far, far better than you are. And we launched these in the USA uh, six months ago on a shopping channel in the USA and people were just like my gosh never seen anything like this before they absolutely loved them and now I get to see all of their makes so they post pictures so you'll be joining a lovely community of lamination crafters who love the sort of watercolour look on cards now you can mix the designs I've done the rose here but you can absolutely mix the designs you could mix the rose with one of the other designs don't be scared of it they're all created so they all mix and match we've got ladies with gowns we've got other buildings like what are in the show today so there's a vast amount out there oh, God, there's so many so so many and every time so say like for instance i haven't had a launch for a few weeks um people always just dig back out the lamination while they're waiting yeah, while they're waiting for you which is lovely i think oh they're because every time you do it, you're going to be different though especially if you're doing the spritz technique because you don't know how they're going to bleed. You don't no. know why them colours are going to work. No, and if you do them on watercolour cards, you get a totally different look. I mean, that looks different to that, doesn't it? It does. Right, so let's clean our dawn. Let's get this outline on here. Super, super easy. So the reason I just cleaned my door there is because it's wet and the okay. stamp will slide around. So make sure you clean your door. But you don't have to clean your door with the ink. Do you know when I told you about leaving the ink on yeah, there? Yeah, if you, when you over... Don't worry about you over ink it and you get that black bit on there. Don't worry about it, apparently, with the Eureka. Yeah, so Water let's pop this on. So, what I was saying about not being precise, it really doesn't matter if this isn't lined up perfectly. Don't worry about it. If you don't line it up great, it's not the end of the world. It still looks awesome. So, make sure this is dry. So, we'll just do it in black for 
telly. Could do it in gold embossing. But you can see from this design how you could easily use it as a stamp on its own. You can see that there. You stamp it out. That's the thing, normally, Kate, you'd have to stamp it like this and colour it in yourself. Yeah. Which would, you'd have to work out what ink you needed because if you're doing it in watercolour, you don't. Oh, look at that. So the stamp has created a uh, white space, which gives you instant light and shade. I don't have to understand light and shade. The stamp's absolutely done it for me, which is awesome. Uh, well, there are loads of things you can do with the stamps as well. Uh, and everyone sort of works in the same way uh, that you've got in that. So if, whether you're going for the um, Eiffel Tower uh, that you've got in there, it will work with those same flowers that you've got. So you can then do all the different designs, but putting them all together. How beautiful is that? Maybe just the rose in the bottom corner that you want to go with. Uh, maybe you're going to pop around a bit of vellum. Maybe you're going to do this on rice paper and insert them into candles. Why not? The choice is yours. Uh, just stamping them out as they are and then embroidering them onto calico. Oh, yeah, somebody already does that in the group. I can't think of that idea is, though, embroiders on them. But they do, to embroider them, so you stamp them as they are, just that one stamp, and then you go in uh, and then you embroider. But you can be doing all these different designs. But look, look at Tony's work now, where all four have been done. And it looks amazing. Looks cool, doesn't it? Abs I mean, look at that. It looks like I've spent ages painting that, haven't I? Do you think? Well, you, you do that as an invitation. You are invited to. Yeah. So I like my sentiments through my artwork. <laughs> yeah, sorry, I just got making sure my sentiment was straight. No, I won't ignore you. That's no, fine. So let's stamp this on here. Shall we do it? No, let's do it in black. Sorry. I don't know what you're thinking, so I can't answer any of these questions you're posing to me. <laughs> <laughs> Should we do it in? Oh, no, we won't. Okay. I don't, I, don't, I don't know what the options were. There we go. Today's always the oh. best day. Look at that. So let's just stick very quickly, stick this onto the card very quickly, and then we'll move on to some other demos because that was quite a long demo for me, actually, wasn't it? It was good, though. We saw it. I, I just want to see it show you, though, that sometimes the lamination. As incredible as they look like an entity on their own, if you do round pages and things like that they and 3D well. them, they also work as well. So I suppose, on. yeah, we've not even spoke about the decoupage aspect of these. No, you could, yeah, to cut away to elements. To cut them out and, and then stick them on again with your foam pads and things like that. Yeah. Look at this. Look at that. Once again, from the happiest to the saddest cards. Yeah. That would work for any, any occasion. Right then. We are busy. Now if you've not already got one of these, I would definitely be thinking about one today, why they're on three flexible payments. These are your Eureka watercolour bundle, it's your 101, um, you've got your tablets in there, so you've got the main element, that is a craft room in a box on its own, but then you also get your scoreboard and your little inkwells with your paintbrush, on one side it's a scoreboard, on the other side it's an envelope and box maker, you also get your carry case and you're also getting your watercolour cardstock and you're also going to get those Stand By Me brushes as well. All of this, £76 and 47 pence is what you're looking at. But the star of the show so far is the bundle that we have. Over 80% of the stock now has already gone. 80% of that stock has, has disappeared. You are absolutely loving it all because you are going to start, I've made a right mess back here, but you are going to start creating cards that look like this, or like this, or like this. And that is just using the one stamp that you've already got in there. But start going down your Matthew Palmer-esque routes that you've got with this. Bringing some other stamps like the birds that you've got. We've got cards like these with just your splatters. How easy to do. I'm guessing, I'm going to go for it, they're pearly wink sprays. They're just a bit. They are your pearly wink sprays that you've got on there. Just blocked off the corner of your card, stamp it up, bosh, you are done. Um, batch making these. Using those backgrounds that you don't know what to do with, those inky backgrounds that you've used again and again and again. The Blackpool Tower that you've got on there with the detail of the lights that you've got. That's my last demo, that one, wasn't it? Was yeah, that, that Adam? Yeah. Yeah, that's the last one we did. Yeah. So that's the one.
But look, Blackpool. Look at the detail that you've got on it. Took a while. Took a while for you to get. Obviously, it's the Arctic Triumph. Uh, but then you've got. I just love it. I genuinely love the detail that you've got on there. Valentine's Day. That on it. That is a classy card. That's a buy Apple. I think so too. You would pay a fortune for that. I think sometimes the simplest of cards are the most expensive. Well, this is a black and white. It reminds me of a certain company, the black and white, two C's together. Um, you know the one? No. Okay, Chanel. Chanel. Coco. Coco Chanel. Uh, that you've got on there. Uh, but it's got, that, it's got that sort of look to it. It's got that... You imagine that as a tag on a little box. And then you've got the card to match as well. Then you've got the envelope as well. It's all there for I'm, you. I'm going to use that one next. She's using that next. And Sweet Pea. Thanks. I'll be there in a minute, don't worry. But, <laughs> little honey bun, but we've got so much that's on the show. And I genuinely, I know we're having a laugh and a giggle, but I genuinely don't need to miss out on these. This is the thing that once they've gone, they have gone. Okay? Once they've gone, they have gone. They won't be coming back. There's not going to be a rerun. To my knowledge at the moment, there's not going to be a rerun of these. So in theory, we can call them a limited edition. Because we had a vast amount of stock. That stock is meant to last for three, four shows. We are approaching 90% of the stock, which means we're approaching limited stock on these. There's already contingencies for tomorrow in place, should this stock not last, because shows will get repeated over the evening as well. So treat this as your last live hour. <laughs> we can see you in the corner of the screen. <laughs> Sorry. Don't, you, don't worry, you never have to apologise, it's your show. Uh, dots and dashes. I'm just here to steer the ship. Uh, dots and dashes at the Weary at the moment. Uh, loving these. You are loving them as well. When was the last time you took your Micron pen and your background was still wet and you tried to do a squiggle and it all bled everywhere? Or you look at that finished card like these, three quarters of the stock already gone. Three quarters of the stock. You try and do that. You do all this big. Oh, lovely. Oh, stunning. How do I do this? How do I do this? I don't know now. I don't want to go. I don't want to go in. I don't want to go in. Are you all right? It sounds like you're building. Um, I don't want to go in with my micron pen. You get the gist. Uh, you go. It's busy. How much has it gone of this? Three quarters of the stock. Three quarters of the stock has already gone. Once again, once it's gone, it is gone. It's not coming back. Right then, I've got stitch, so I need just a little break, just for a moment, to rehydrate. While we do that, have you got your tickets to see our tone and the gang? All oh, the gang will be there. Oh, yes, the big old gang. Uh, they'll all be there at Doncaster, but you need your tickets. Now, when this starts, watch the woman run through the door. Watch, she's going to the buffet. Tickets are on sale now for Crafting Live at Doncaster Racecourse on the 9th and 10th of July, featuring exclusive offers and competitions. Sign up for free make and takes, stock up on all your crafty goodies from a vast range of exhibitors and watch live guest demonstrations. We'll also be broadcasting live, so join our audience and meet our presenters after the show. Club members, you'll save 25% off your ticket price. So treat yourself or someone special to a great day out and book your tickets now at CreightonCraft.com and search Crafting Live. We look forward to seeing you there. Yes, in there. Uh, Tony's not going to be there, but she's here. That's the conversation we had last time. Uh, she's here. I'm not going either. I'm not there. Are you not? Uh, they won't have me. I, w I was asked, and then no, one, no one's mentioned it since. <laughs> uh, are you free? I was like, yeah, I'm free. Then no one spoke about it since. Uh, so I'm guessing I'm not going either. It was awkward, wasn't it? And that was from the head of TV. Now, not that I'm bitter in the slightest, but you know. We're limited stock. <laughs> 
limited stock on your new and exclusive is what we're looking at on this one, uh, which means I've got less than 10% of the stock left, £24.98. If you're not in the club, that price will get even better if you are in the club. Let's quickly get to demo. Yeah, so I'm going to mix it all up a little bit and show you how they all work together gorgeously. So I have as if here, and it's those lovely dies and the stamp. So on the stamp, look here, you get the super large starring dots and the hats, and then you get all of the words. Okay, but the beauty of this um, die, and it's the first time we've done it, and it was such a success that we're actually doing some in Christmas as well. Nice. So they're launching in a couple of weeks, Christmas ones. But basically, normally when you have a die of a word, you have the outline, and it's a matte and layer, and you get like an outline all the way around, where this is totally different. Okay, so basically, the die fits seamlessly on top of the other oh. die. So normally when you make a die, it, to save metal, you do the outline around because obviously that comes out of the centre. So that's why you've got them like, you've only got this amount of words because they're the same. Can we see? Yeah, exactly, exactly the same, the same. But the results, and they are so worth it, are like this. So the black, or the coloured portion, comes through the backside of that first die, creating this gorgeous, gorgeous 3D effect. But what you'll find is you get a panel in each one. So in the panel, you can stamp... Um, the sentiments that are within here as well. So you've got like, for, for a special, bestest ever, thanks for being my, and then the bolt on. And the words that are in here in the die cuts are really unique. So you have, oh gosh, which is really different. I don't think I've ever seen that. No. We've got laugh, we've got friend, we've got love, and then we've got as if, like as if it's your birthday, as if I forgot it's your birthday, and things like that. So it's really, really cool. So these are... Oh, best buds forever, best as if. Bus, yeah, as if, yeah. <laughs> as if. Best buds forever. So yeah, that's what I mean. You can <laughs> you can sort of um, make it fitting for the person if they've got if they like a good pun or a bit of a laugh or I you like, like to it. bully them or sort of pull the leg. Should I use a different word? Um, you know, if you like a bit of a joke, you can yeah. pick the appropriateness for each person. You I make guess. me laugh. As yeah, if. as if. <laughs> right. Where were I? Right, OK, let's nice. bring in our Eureka look. So what we're going to do here is we're going to mix it all up because we can't really... There are no rules, are there? So let's have a look on here. On here we've got Precious Sweet Pea and it's that beautiful, beautiful, gorgeous border. So you get Sweet Peas at the bottom and then you get the foliage. So let's stamp this very quickly on the top corner. Now, the beauty of this one is Sweet Peas go in all directions. So you're never going to um, have them thinking that's actually upside down because they go in all directions. And again, look, you can see ink on my Eureka. It will not matter at all. It won't transfer across. Don't worry about it. There we go. So you kick that beautiful design which you can watercolour. Let's very quickly show you the tower on here now. So let's pop the tower just popping up here. Look, so I showed you this one earlier. It's just so cool. So stamp it in black. You can do the colour first if you want to. Do It's totally up to you. Let's just stamp this in black. So this is just to show you that the florals work brilliantly as a backdrop, a card filler, if you don't want them to be the focus. Then you can absolutely go to town with cross-pollinating the designs. So this is the solid portion. Now, if you just want the tower, just do the tower you can mask it off you don't have to have all of the lamination element of it and then we're just going to grab the solid portion which is where we're going to add our color now i don't really know exactly where this needs to be so what am i going to do i'm going to grab my packaging, packaging and i'm going to let it help me um pop it on there when i find it i'm going to go for it anyway i think i'm well, down there yes please thank you so i can see here look just bring it into shot just need to nudge it up, but if you don't get it right, it's not the end of the world. <laughs> We're bit, so, I haven't got many left of these now. So we did. I haven't got many. We did left. red and orange on the other one, didn't? Shall we do teal on Let's this do one? Teal. I'll do a teal flower head. I got eight left. I don't know if I'm meant to tell you that. And then we'll add a bit of green. So, and then these just look beautiful on vellum and things like that. Got blue, let's add a touch of um, colour in there as well. I don't know, I'm just playing with colour here. Just have fun. Seven left. Oh, it's good. To, it's, it's like a bidding channel. <laughs> Give it a good old spray. Six left of the new and exclusive. Push it down and look, you can see that beautiful watercolour image is just going to go onto that card absolutely beautifully. 
Oh, look at that. Now, you could incorporate these and do coordinating if you want to. I'm not going to move that, actually. I need my leaves to just be a bit greener, so they're stepping away. Now, you can do oranges, pinks, purples. I've tried to do it a bit of a different colour there. So I'm just going to add that green on there to try and get it to step away from the blue. There we go. That's a bit better. Oh. And then, what you can do is those sentiments have those beautiful stars and oh, yeah. hearts look on there so let's do a very faint star because this is paris it's not blackpool it's paris uh, i've never been both let's just get rid of the water I've never been to any of them <laughs> so here we're just sort of accenting so you sort of like layer building. Can you imagine your jelly plates and your oh. colours and really, really? And go they would work on your jelly plates as well because they're non-directional stamps because they're just flowers and things. They would really, really stand out really well. So here I've just done a green to try and tie in a bit of, let's add a bit of pink as well. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just adding a bit of random colour here. Start checking out your baskets. If you I can see oh, now, I've got that. that lovely star. Let's just make it a bit darker. I like these well because they're quite modern. But yet you can turn them into, you could go old school with them if you wanted to, if you want modern kids cards, things like that, teenage cards. Yeah, I think it's just really cool. There we go. Oh. So let's do that. And then the words that you die cut, let's bring these in. So let's do laugh and then let's pick a word. So let's just do laugh out loud or laugh together. Let's do laugh together. I haven't seen that one yet. And then all I'm going to do is I'm going to pop this on a block. Ink it up, and then all you do is you stamp into this little recess here. So I'll just move this out of the way for a second, and then just stamp into here very carefully. Laugh together, and then let's pop this onto our card. So be be creative with your colour. Try and step away from your pinks, purples, peaches, oranges, what we always do. That was my first demo. I'm alright telling you when I do it myself. Um, and p think about some blues and teals if you can, if you've got the um, confidence and courage to try. And then you can pop your sentiment. Oh, look at this. Let's do it on an angle, shall we? Just be a little bit different. Just because it's your card and you can do as you please. Look at that for a card. And that's all done in real time, apart from that's the the actual card itself. That whole I thing was done in real time. I would probably colour the sweet peas and enjoy the process of that as well, but it just shows you that, you know, mix them in. The smaller stars in there, smaller hearts, mix them all in. Beautiful for any card that you're giving to somebody that you love, whether it be that's a friend, true. a partner, a child, anybody. And they're also, they're also less formal. They've yeah. got that nice pally thing yeah, about yeah. them. They're not that oh, happy birthday. It's not that sort of regimented thing. They are quite laughing and jokey. But if you want them, though, uh, you need to be quick at these as well. 568691 is your item number that you're looking at on this one. £33.98 pence is where you're going as well. Let me show you the sweet pea as well while we're here. We might as well. Um, let me show you the sweet pea because this has been busy as well. Waiting two months for this now you have. You've been waiting two months uh, for this to come back. It's now back take advantage why it's here 18 pounds 99 pence is where we're going right then we are super super limited stock i have less than a handful okay i have two percent of the stock left of my new and exclusive this is well, this is the thing, this is meant to last two days. Two days is where this is meant to last. We've had two hour shows. So we've had two hours on this. It's brand, brand new. It's new to us here on the channel. Not been seen before. It is your double bubble, as it were. Now I'm hearing now, if you don't check out now, you will miss out on these. This is the time that if you are sitting on the fence, if you're thinking, oh, I'll wait till tomorrow. There will not be a tomorrow. These, well, there'll be a tomorrow, but not for this. You know what I mean. There will be a tomorrow, don't worry. But there won't, well, there won't be a tomorrow. If you're going to miss out on this, once it's gone, it's gone. And if it's that, if, it's that, if you live by that thing of, oh, if I think about it when I wake up, then, I, then it's meant to be. And that's the thing. That's how I live here, right? If there's something that you want and you think, I'd like to have a little go, but 
I don't know. If I'll think I'll sleep on it tonight. If it's the first thing I think of in the morning, obviously it's meant to be. It's that's that's the way I sort of work. But this won't be here tomorrow, we don't think. Well, I can tell you it won't be. I know it won't be here tomorrow. Sixty-seven pounds and forty-six pence is what you're looking at if you're in the club. And I'll also put this onto interest-free flexible payments for you as well to make it even easier. Twenty-two pounds and forty-nine pence is where you're looking at for the full collection. The full collection to get home and start making and selling. I said it yesterday, I had, to try, I had to try and make a wedding card. To make a wedding card, I had to go to a shop, I couldn't find one I liked, well, I, could, I forgot to actually buy one. Uh, then I went home and I tried and made one, but I didn't have the stamps to make it. In the end, I rustled up something, but I didn't have the stamps like this. I could use these for the wedding cards, and on the same, I could use them for birthday cards. You could even use these as Father's Day cards. The city one as a Father's Day card would be absolutely beautiful. I was going to say get that city card because that is uh, just the city one is really different. So if you are a collector of sorry a collector of lamination, sorry, um, you will know that um, we do lots and lots of florals because that's where we started out. And we started yeah, incorporating yeah. gowns and things like that. That was one from earlier. These are demos from earlier, yeah. So you can see how and that's ink. That was the ink swiping where we swiped it down the card, didn't we? Um, I love it. And just that as a Father's Day card would be amazing. It would be absolutely stunning. Fastest finger fingers first. first. I have. Oh dear. I have. <laughs> I've got one left. Oh. If it's in your basket, <laughs> if you're in your just basket, check your basket out. Shake your pants. It's like Trevor and Simon swing your pants. Do you remember? Sold out. <laughs> it's technically sold out. Well done, everyone. Now, this is the serious bit. <laughs> if it's in your basket, you need to check out your basket. At the moment, it's a technical sellout. A technical sellout means there's still people sitting within the basket and it's not yours until you go all the way through the process. Oh. Until you put your card details in. So until that point, I may say, oh, some have bounced back. It will only sit in your baskets for 15 minutes, and then I put them back on the shelf. Right then, um, let's do the dots and the dashes. Let's have a little look at the dots and the dashes, and we'll go back to demo and we work out what we're doing. Uh, this is the dots and dashes that you're looking at now. Um, there's loads that you can do with these, with their beautiful borders uh, that you are looking at. £32.98 is where you're looking at for this one. Don't pay that though. Do not pay £32.98. Become a club member. £29.68 is where you're going at with this. And it's on interest-free flexible payments as well. Interest-free flexible payments. Now, but 80%. Oh, better hurry This up. could be our next sellout. 80% of the stock has gone. And this is genuinely won't be coming back again. Will not be coming back again. Again, next time it comes back, it may look slightly different. So this is now at the end of the run. You can get them together, but this is the end of the run. Righty then, uh, 688385 is that item number. Let's get demoing, 80% of the stock has already okay. gone. How much time have we got left, please? We have um, 11, no, we have eight minutes. Oh, that's all right. Look, you're making me panic. I've got loads of time. Am I making you panic? I haven't given you a time check. I'm panicking here. It is eight minutes, is it not, Ed? Oh, Seven that's and a half amazing, right. Right, beautiful buttercups, slimline ones. These are so gorgeous. So gorgeous, I cannot tell you. <laughs> <laughs> that's the end of that conversation, mate. Well, so you can see, they are two really long. So think about your five by seven cards, this one on the left, this one on the right. The beautiful few slimline cards, should you wish. But let me just show you. It'd be a nice gate card as well, gate oh, card cards. Just, just yeah. on one either side. Yeah, like absolutely. Flowers on one side, leaves and on the, the other. Because they've got those large open spaces in there, you can just enjoy the colouring process. It's amazing. So I'm going to go tall and thin on this one. I'm just going to pop it down the side. Look, look how gorgeous this looks when it's stamped. It's so pretty. We'll just do it in black. Okay. Very, very quickly. So these are your slimline cards. These go in your DL envelopes. I know you've heard people say slimline. It's just a new terminology for DL. So we'll go in all of the envelopes that you come with your, your DL cards. So let's just stamp that down the side. Look at that. Look. Look at that. Is that not just gorgeous? I mean, that in itself. Let's just grab one of these sentiments very quickly. Let's have a coloured one there. Eh? Oh, yeah, let's go glitter. 
Let's go sparkle. We've got as if here looking purple. Well, as if, and then the, oh, the white outline oh, yes. fits seamlessly on top. No, so you don't see the purple outline, so you can see that there. There we go. And then you stamp whatever you want in the centre, and you could just stick that on. But we're not going to do that, because I've got time. So I just want to show you those dot dash frames, how they come as a big entity like this look. But to show you how you can sort of like do one around here if you want to. So I'm just going to grab the design. Pop it on where I want it. So I want the design to start at the side of that buttercup there, come all the way down, and then I'll just fill this little space in a second. So let's just move that. Normally, out of the way. is you'd have to get your micron pen, and you'd have to have a really steady hand, and you'd have to be confident. I think as well, because it's good that, that you've got a stamp, you get matching. Mm. So if you do another card now, it'll match, which would be nice. So let's just do a black. Now I know they're here. frames, but if I wanted them sort of even more squiggly and jiggly, I could move that in because it's just sticking to my Eureka, so I could reposition of the... Of course you could, yeah. So I'll go all the way down here. So I'm just inking the areas where I need the die, the, the um, line to be. A bit further. Don't be precious about it. If it goes into your design, you know, it's part of the creativity. There we go, so let's stamp that. Top, 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 down the side. So now wow. I've got like a frame coming down here. I'm not going to bother with this because I'm going to put a sentiment there. But let me show you one that I painted and sparkled up. Oh, that's nice. Can you see that there? So yeah. two slim lines. So I used both here. That works though. Look really, really cool, don't they? So let me just very quickly show you what I did on that one. So that is a completely flat card. But can you see I popped a halo around in grey? Yeah. So it looks 3D. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to enhance this a little bit further and just show you how I did that because sometimes people like the look of 3D but don't like the dimension on the cards. So I've just got a grey ink pad. Now you can do this with an alcohol marker in grey if you want to. And I just, not that one, I need a finer one, this one. So I'm just going to pick up some of this grey here and I'm just going to paint an outline around. Now when you, when you first pop it down it'll look pretty dark. But have the confidence to pop it down because it really does dry back. Like this one that's on now were quite dark, um, but it dried right back. Watercolouring always dries about two shades lighter. Okay, so have the confidence. If you put it on and it's a bit dark, just have the courage to go for it because as you can see now, it's pretty much, you can't see it. Oh. Uh, oh my if you want the brushes as well, if you think you've got a lot, then brushes, uh, they come with the Eureka. They're in the bundle for your Eureka. You're getting your Eureka, you're getting your brushes, you're getting your paper as well. Can you see it? Oh, thank you. Can you see it now? That's very, that's very kind. Thank you very much. Oh, and then look, I've got the shakes now. So you just outline the design with the grey. If you've got grey pencils, alcohol markers, whatever it is, can you see that there? Yeah, and then when that. it dries back, your actual image looks like it's 3D. It looks like it's off the page. Now, the great thing about these designs is you can have them like so, like landscape or portrait. Open spaces again, but equally if you want to, let me just see if I have my pen, because if, if I have it'd be a great demo, but I haven't, so it's pants. If you have a micron pen, yeah. you could zentangle, because oh. they're so big of the areas you can absolutely zentangle in there. So that's the end of that demo. I'll do some numbers. Uh, 18 pounds and 99 pence is what we're looking at for this one. 377163 is your item number. Um, uh, let's let's look at these in a picture. Is where we're going to go with that one. I can do uh, another. I've got another though. You got another demo. Okay, we'll stay here then. Uh, Eighteen pounds and ninety-nine pence. How long we got? We got two and a half minutes. Oh, it's all right. I'll just shoot. I'll quickly do it. Okay. Uh, three seven seven one six three is your item number for that one. Yep. Uh, and let me show you as if as well. Uh, just quickly, there's your as if. If you want your sentiments, there's your as if sentiments. There they all are. Thirty-three pounds, ninety-eight pence. Don't be paying that. Come part of the club. Let right then, five, six, seven, two minutes. Oh, it's chaos, isn't it? Look, it looks like. Oh, let's just make a bit of space here. Right, let's just do a bit of die cutting. Look. Ah, oh. this is cute. There's my plates. Now, he's a cute little die. I've not seen this before. Do we sell yeah. this? It's out of stock. Okay. So, Again, we have like a, pe anything else you bring a piece of me. light and a piece of black, okay? So let's cut out the one of the beautiful dies. So, the solid portion, think about, is the colour that comes through the back, and then the top portion is um, the, the way you're going to stamp. So if you do it in black, think about what you're going to have to stamp this, this, the words on. Oh, right, okay. So laugh. So you just said, how long do we have left for the show? Laugh. Right, so, stop. Alright, so anyway, so 
pop it on. Honestly, ladies and gents, if you could hear what's going on in my ear. I just can't oh, see so you there. <laughs> We've got a minute left. I feel like I'm in sack race. <laughs> I'm under pressure here. <laughs> I'm in egg race. <laughs> oh, so I'm just going to run it. <laughs> <laughs> Listen. Oh gosh. Does it give me a you. negative as well? So it gives me the separate letters if I wanted to use. <laughs> yes. Yes. yes so you get your outline look and then you get your solid. Uh, sorry. <laughs> and you just need to get your poker tool look, okay. ladies and gents, and just pop out the recess. And then when you stick them together, you get these sort of looks, okay? <laughs> so I'm sorry about. I'm sorry about Ed right now. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Oh gosh. It's time's up. Friends. Oh gosh, friends. <laughs> well. That is it, genuinely. That is the end of the hour. Sold out of your new and exclusive. I don't think Tony will be back tomorrow morning. Nothing to do with the show, just our conduct during it. Uh, but... Yours. Uh, <laughs> I've got it anyway. Uh, thanks, Tony. Always a pleasure. Thank you, guys. Uh, see you later. Thank you for checking out your baskets as well. I'll see you next hour. Don't go anywhere. Right then. Up next, one day special. I'll tell you the story when we get over there. But they're making me do something I genuinely don't think I can do.